activities. The only league in football that is running in the world is the Belarusian Football League. That is the only league in the world that uh, is uh, running. But uh, we'll not uh, be taking a look at that. Rather, in this show today, we'll be taking a look at some of the m biggest moments that we've had so far before the season came to an halt. Remember, all sporting activities came to an halt uh, because of the coronavirus pandemic. So we'll be taking a look at uh, some of the biggest moments over the season. Our pundits will be giving us uh, some of the moments that they feel have. Uh, uh, rather defined the season up to the moment uh, that uh, most uh uh, leagues were suspended in football, in uh, hockey, in rugby, in athletics, in uh, all other spheres of uh, the sporting world. But before we get into that, how well do you know your footballing stars? So we are issuing a challenge here if you know your footballing stars and we want to, we are giving out. Uh, Seven silhouettes, we want you to tell us if you know your sporting uh, stars. Of course, we have the first one. Uh, just giving you small clues is one of the most famous footballers that we have in the world. Second is uh, one of the fastest rising stars in world football. Third, he's a man that has been of talk in town for the past three months. And fourth, he's a famous African footballer. Uh, fifth, uh, one of the greatest uh, players that we've seen in the English Premier League. Six, he's a man that you cannot talk about La Liga without talking about. And seven, one of the biggest sport, uh, football stars in Serie A. So those are just some of the clues in identifying some of uh, these uh, footballing stars. How well do you know them? Of course, we'll be revealing at the end of the show who they are and also we'll be taking a look at uh, some of your feedback if uh, you know these uh, stars, if you've uh, answered correctly who these uh, stars are. So I want us to kick off a scholar in this afternoon. Remember, it's all about uh, staying at home, working from home. And right here at uh, KTN Sports, of course, we are working on shifts. And last week, Moses Wahisi was right here on Scotland, both on Saturday and Sunday. So I reached out to him and I wanted to know what he's doing during this time that he's at home. Take a look. Stega Thomas taken me back uh, to martial arts and yes, a sport that I so, so much used to love, but I know I still got the tricks. Now, wearing the gi, or some other people like to call it the karate gi, is not too, very, very hard, very, very easy procedures. You can see this will take me more than uh, 10 seconds. But I know a lot of people usually have a difficult time when it comes to putting on this belt. For me, it is black. And yes, I do respect it. This is how I like to put it on. Very, very easy to the back. Back to the front, it must fit properly. And then my right side, I always like to put it up. When it's up, you take it under. And back up. Yes, the tight is good. I love this game. Today's practice day. And who? Well, uh, Moses Wahisi right there showing us how to tie the black belt and he said that uh, he's going to be practicing that uh, during uh, this uh, period. Remember, he comes back next week. He will be right here on uh, Scotland. So uh, let's move away from Moses Wahisi. Let's take a look at some of the players that we have in different sports here in the country and uh, how they're keeping fit uh, during this uh, season that uh, the leagues have been suspended. We begin with the... Uh, hockey and it's all about the captain of the national women's hockey team uh, that is Jill Okumu who is one of the players who is literally working from home during this pandemic. Let's take a look at a training regime. Uh, due to the corona pandemic I have been forced to work from home and do some exercises to keep fit so that when I go back to training I don't start from zero. So I normally wake up in the morning at around six I go, I, I go for my normal jog, I run from here to Mtindua, I do the stairs thing for around 30 minutes, then I come back jogging and getting to the house, I do some few exercises which is planks, uh, I do co-work, I do leg work, I do jumps, I do squats, I do uh, lunges so that I can just keep myself in shape because you know Corona has made us just stay at home and eat, <laughs> sleep and do other things. So. Uh, 
social distancing has made me do all these things alone because you never trust the person who's next to you. So I normally do them alone in the house and that's what keeps me going. To hockey fans, I want to urge you to follow government orders so that we can keep ourselves safe. And um, you know, personal discipline is what will help us throughout this pandemic. If we all obey the rules and the regulations that the government has set, then we will be safe from uh, this coronavirus. And I wish to see you all after all this is done and gone. We'll be back in action and sure, we'll meet again. Of course, uh, Jile Okumu, uh, former Strathmore player, right now she plays in Germany. That is for entrance of Frankfurt. Let's move on to the other player that we spoke to earlier on in the week, and now he's uh, keeping fit, and it's all about uh, Samuel Onyango. Remember, the Gormaia midfielder uh, says that uh, he wakes up early to make sure that uh, he goes through his uh, training schedules, uh, j just to make sure that he's fit. If uh, the league returns, then he will have to. He will be able to fit in with the rest. Samuel Onyango. Since the pandemic of Corona COVID-19 has been so challenging to us as players. It's to make indoors, but most of the time as players, there are some things we need to do to keep ourselves fit. So my daily routine, I always wake up in the morning before what was happening. I go for my morning run. I do my, my exercise, I do push-up, I do squats. I juggle ball at least to keep me fit. Then uh, in the course of the day, I enjoy myself playing my FIFA 19, my FIFA 20. Then later again at uh, the day, when I attend a jogging later in the, in the evening. So my advice to Kenya to keep too calm. As you can see, this thing can contain it. And hopefully we'll come back in the pitch we play. We miss it really a lot, it's a challenge that. But we are keeping strong, we have been together as one, and you know, very soon things are going to work out na tuarudi kwa uwanja hivi karibuni naweza to my fans na all the football lovers in the country we keep too calm we follow the directive kutoka ya government we keep social distance we sanitize wash mkono hii kitu ni muda tu it won't take forever but very soon tutarudi to keep too calm na tupetu pamoja kwa nyumba it's the time to enjoy their family so just stay safe and stay home also, the Gormai attacking midfielder showing us uh, what he goes uh, through during this time to make sure that he keeps fit. Now let's uh, stick with the Kenya Premier League and it's all about uh, Mike Kibuage. The KCB defender says that he has to make sure that he uses the space that he has at home to keep fit uh, during this uh, uh, Corona, uh, coronavirus pandemic that has ravaged through the world. So let's take a look at what Michael Kibuage does. <laughs> Uh, this country needs you. Na e coronavirus pia yezi to be a killer plants. So for now stay home because it's a serious virus. But pia usi actually evora isi. So keep exercises pia in as idea. Training pia in as idea so you can just do it from home. We have a lot of exercises to do. We have the core exercises which you can do, the push-ups the sit-ups and the likes, so don't sit and relax, just give your best, work hard, try to exercise every day, like for me, for instance, I work in the morning, in the afternoon and in the, in the evening, so just have to push yourself because that's how you can kick it. If you just relax for, at one place, it's, it's not good. Even for your health, you'll keep remembering it, then it disturbs you mentally. So you can just keep fit, try doing something, you can get it out of your mind. So we just pray to God also to be able to help us to come out of this. To our daily activities, to miss ball sana. I guess the ball while kitu napenwa sana kila mtu so to miss ball sana. Na fatu tuombe mungu sana to come out of this safe then to do our daily activities. Mikey Bwage giving us the daily activities uh, that he undertakes uh, to make sure that he keeps fit uh, during uh, this uh, time. He's a KCB uh, defender in the Kenya Premier League. Of course, so those are uh, some of the uh, players that are giving us uh, their uh, training regime 